got one. Just a little one. Oh, oh man. It was actually swimming towards me that whole time. It wasn't just a little one. It started to pull at the end there, but I didn't have the, he didn't have the hook set. Thought I had the hook set. Down. Oh man, that was a explosion on it right there. He came completely out of the water. Oh, something just blew up on the top water over there too. Oh, had him. Not getting any bites on anything. So I'm throwing a skinny Senko. Maybe I can get a sunfish. All right, I'm going back to the popper now. Oh man, right away I had something. Oh, I just got one. Wow, I had two on the same cast. That was crazy. As soon as it hit the water over there, something took it and I missed the hook set and it came flying at me and it hit the water over here and another one took it. 13 inches, actually 13 and a half, but the ruler's a little fuzzy, so I'll give myself 13, cut it down. And there it goes. That was crazy though. I had one fish bite it over there. When I tried to set the hook, it came flying over here. And as soon as it hit the water over here, another one took it. Oh, oh come on, stay on. Oh, damn it. I missed the hook set because of the damn tree branch. That was a solid fish. That was definitely bigger than the last one. Oh, there's one. <clears throat> Get him on the retrieve. That one was on the paddle tail it's worm. This one is just a little bit over 14 inches, but I'm gonna round it down to 14. And off it goes. Okay, now I've actually caught one on each bait, except for this one, so now I need to catch one here. I'll stay on. Damn it. I had my first bite on this bait. Let's try it again. Okay, well, I just had a major, major blow to my recording ability. My chest strap broke. I'm trying to uh, rig it up here. But I can't get... I'm, I got a pipe cleaner in here. If nothing else, I'll just tie it on with some line or something. This is gonna seriously affect my my recording for a while until I can get a new one. Yeah, uh, it doesn't quite reach. There we go, got it. Okay, that should hold it all in place for the time being. It sucks that that took about 20 minutes out of my time and the sun is in a drastically different spot now. And I had just had a bite and I lost the Christy, Christy Critter. So that's what I was trying to get another one on for because I just had a bite on it.
but I think it's cooled down and all the fish have moved out to the middle of the lake here. Oh, the guys across from me finally got one, so it looks like they had moved across the lake over there. Those guys haven't had anything all day. At least since I've been here, they haven't had one. There we go. That is a fish. That is... Uh, it's pulling drag, too. This thing's fighting pretty hard. It's not even that big. This is, my, this is the smallest one of the day, and it was fighting harder than the other ones. Just realized I forgot something. Oh, that sucks. I forgot to plug my charger back into my camera, and... Now it's all covered in mud and water. I can't believe I did that. And that, that I need to, I'm not used to using a bait caster. I don't use them very often. So that one was pulling drag like crazy. I need to readjust that. But yeah, that's uh, at least one fish on each of the baits I'm using today, with the exception of the uh, skinny Sanko, but that's, I wasn't planning on using that today anyway. That is the first bass on this rod, actually. So, it was just a little, little bitty 11 incher, but I'll take it. Got another one, this one feels good. Oh, he slipped off. It felt like another big one, or like a bigger one, but I think it was about the same size. All right, I think it's recording, but uh, yeah, battery died. I don't think it had anything quite to do with the charger getting wet, but who knows. Anyway, this is my backup GoPro. just uploaded or submitted my fish to some tournaments see how I do these should put me in the first place in one tournament where I'm currently in second place and uh, should at least bump me up from the other tournament I'm in 14th place it should bump me up to like 10th <laughs> so Oh, that's a, oh, I just missed him. He took it on my first pop. I set the hook and he let go. That was a, uh, felt like a solid fish. Probably would have been bigger than anything else I caught today. And there's another one popping right out there. Got him. I let him hold it for a while. Set the hook. I really hope that came out on the camera. Cause that was a nice topwater strike and then you could probably see him the whole time if it did pick it up. They have worked a lot of bugs out on this app. I'm gonna say there's still a few issues but they've worked most of the bugs out. 12 inch bass. If I can get my footing here. I tied on the skinny Sanko. If I can land one on the skinny Sanko, that'll be a hat trick. I've already got one, at least one on all my other baits.
Okay. Yeah, there we go. Got one right there as soon as it hit the water. Fighting pretty hard for a little one. Oh, this is the biggest one I got out here. And I lost my Senko. But that's all right. Worth it. Now I've got a 12 inch in my in my live well right now, so I don't need a 10 inch. And there's the hat trick with this one. I, had, I it looks like I'm throwing them rough, but I just had to get them to the edge of the mat all right uh just had that fish uh i actually just threw two casts and had two bites so i'm gonna keep throwing until i stop getting bites which i mean that's not gonna be too much longer it's gonna be pretty dark soon in fact i'm not even sure if you can see what's going on on the camera might not be enough light but <clears throat> it's all right i'm just gonna keep fishing anyway if i can't use the footage i can't use the footage Got him. Yep, this one feels like a better one. About the same. A little bit heavier. Wow, it is dark. I need to find some kind of light. Nope. It is too dark to fish, so I'm not going to take pictures of them anymore. It's too dark for pictures anyway, not too dark to fish. <laughs> 